So Radical Grime School is an idea that Commonwealth and No Hats Know has jointly worked on and the idea is to bring elements of theatre and drama and combine them with grime and just basically the DIY ethos of how you can achieve things with limited resources and limited opportunities and off your own back so that you're not waiting for someone to give you a break, you're going out and making stuff happen. Over the six days we've basically um, invited a lot of uh, incredible people, incredible artists to join us. They've basically come down and, and been directly working with the kids one-on-one -on -one and uh, teaching them about their own practice as grime artists. We brought down Maxter, uh, now goes by the name of Ian, and we brought down Blakey, who's a very talented actor and a rapper, uh, and we've worked with the record label to provide this opportunity. I think it's very important for people from working class backgrounds to have these opportunities because it really showcases the talent in the area that people might not necessarily know about. A lot of what this has been about has been about authenticity and being yourself. Um, so like telling their own stories, but being being truthful, being authentic, having like that integrity. And people that have come to this really love grime music. And through that, using that as a vehicle, we've been able to access loads of different things with them. Acting, singing, rapping, in a space over six days as a catalyst to create something which has led us to making a short performance that we shared today which I think is really important for young people to be able to be honest and vulnerable and open about their lived experience. I've learned from that just like who cares what people think you got you got to do stuff that makes you happy innit? I also think that it, it's like helping children like giving them something to do rather than just hanging around the street. I've been writing about equality what I'd do if I was Prime Minister and in my lyrics push a meaning for what I want and make sure my message has gone across to everyone. People who I've never even met before encouraging me to do big things like that is just man, one of the best things I've done in my life is coming here. We've had a concept, we've created it together and we've gone through a process where we plan things out and then we devise some sort of performance and we come together at the end and perform it. And just going through that process alone, I feel like it's very important and it gives them an opportunity to see how things are made, how things are structured. And hopefully, no matter what they're doing creatively, they know what process to follow and they have the confidence to do that. And there's nothing to stop them. The world is that oyster. It's not just we did a six day workshop that we did it and then nothing's happening like off the back of this. There's three or four young people that are releasing music, they are going to do music videos, so it's been nice to see that progression route, really. So the future of Radical Grime School is we're hoping to, to build on it. We've already built on it. We've done like a one-day one, we've done a six-day one, and we want to build it bigger in the future. So I think if you're interested in grime, if your kids are interested in grime and performing and politics, then stay connected to Commonwealth Theatre, commonwealththeatre.co.uk, and we'll have something coming soon. Select, select, select,